Hello YouTube, my name is Fred Bergeron from Inaxis. Welcome to the channel. If you're new to us, please subscribe. And if you have any comments, send them down below. We'll be very happy to help you, okay? So in front of me today, I have a wide array of Ajax systems devices, all right? Going from the main hub, which is the brain of the system, motion detectors, motion detectors with, you know, uh, glass break detectors inside, uh, sirens, keypads, uh, and also door protects, all right? So, obviously, to arm and disarm the system, you can use a keypad, you can use a mobile phone, but there's also this, um, this space control device here that you want to have a look at. So, this is a very useful device. We think that every client, every job site should be using them. If your phone has no batteries, if you let your phone in the car, um, this is a very easy way to arm and disarm the system, okay? So today, I'm going to show you how you can actually add the remote to the system and how to link the remote to a user, okay? To start, this remote has four buttons. Basically, here you have the disarm button, the arm button, the panic button, and the night mode arming button. So if you're home, you want to arm the perimeter of the system, you can press the, the night mode button and then just the perimeter will be armed, okay? So let's have a look at the mobile app. I want to show you how to add this device to the system. Okay, so from the devices menu, you want to click on add device. Okay, so we'll give the device a name. So for the device ID, you have two options. You can actually get the device ID from this code here underneath the box, okay, or you can simply open the device. Um, you know, some may find that it's easier to open with a credit card. Um, if you like to play guitar, if you have some good nails, then you can actually open it up easily like this. So you will see that underneath the uh, device here, you have the QR code that you can scan with your phone's camera to add, just like other devices we've looked at in the past, okay? So let me just grab my phone here. So I want to hit this. Zoom, make a good focus on the QR code. Obviously now we want to close this remote properly. There's four little tabs that you need to align. Uh, and it's also interesting, a good video if you want to know how to open it up and replace the battery because it, it, the battery is on the circuit board here. Okay, I want to close this. It's easier to close and open like that. Okay, and it's flashing a few times to show that it's now closed. So when you click on add device, you have a few seconds to press the arming and the, the panic button all together. Okay, and that's it. My space control is now connected to the system. Okay, so if I close this, I can now, uh, uh, you know, arm the system. I get the notification of arming. I can now disarm the system from here, okay? So this is very light. It's a very minimalistic device. It's very light, so you can attach this to your key set, keep this in your pockets, and then it's very easy to disarm and arm the system with this remote. So this was a review of the uh, Ajax Systems uh, Space Control Remote, and we showed how to add this to the hub. Uh, remember that the Nexus is a distributor of Ajax system products. We have all of these products that are in front of me in stock, ready to ship today. So if you uh, are interested in buying this system, please contact the sales department with the Nexus and they will you know, be more than happy to help you. This is Fred Bergeron from Inaxis. Thank you for watching.